The new concept which we are going to learn here is subtracting using the beads. Earlier in the method we saw that we just draw the lines and we were striking off. Now in this method we will be drawing the number of beads and then we will strike off whatever number we need to subtract. So shall we see with an example children? Okay. Now what number is this? This is number 5 and I need to subtract 2 from 5. So what is the first step? I will be drawing here 5 beads. Just count and tell whether it is 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yes? Now I need to strike here 2 beads, right? So I will strike here 1, 2. What is the number of beads remaining with me? Just count and tell. 1, 2, 3. So, my answer is 3. And I will draw here 3 beads. Is it clear children? So, shall we see with the next example? Now, the next one is 9 minus 4. Now, what is the first step? We need to draw 9 beads. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. How many beads do we have to cut from it or strike out? 4. So just strike off 1, 2, 3, 4. So what is the number of beads remaining? 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. So the answer is 5 and I will draw here 5 beads. Is it clear children? Now the next one is I have 6 beads with me and I need to reduce 4 from it. So what is the answer? I will be drawing here 6 beads. Just count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and I need to strike off 4 from it. So what is the answer remaining? 1, 2. So the balance is 2 and I will be drawing 2 beads here. Okay. Shall we do with the last sum here? Now I have 7 and I need to reduce 3 from it. So what is the first step children? I will draw 7 beads here. Shall we count? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. I need to strike off 3 from here. 1, 2 and 3. So what is the balance? 1, 2, 3, 4. So my answer is 4 and I need to draw here 4 beads. That 4 is my answer. Okay. So I hope this method was equally interesting for you to learn, right? So was it informative and important for you all? Yes. So shall we do a quick recap? So what did we learn here? That in the first case when there were 5 and when the 5 is reduced by 2, the answer is 3. Similarly, 6 when reduced by 4 gives me an answer. 2, 9, when reduced by 4, give me an answer, 5. And 7, when reduced by 3, gives me an answer, 4. Okay? So, I hope the concept of this subtraction was equally important and was equally interesting to you, how you learned with the addition.